Hello and welcome to Game Dev One. I am going to be showing you how to make a 3D platformer quite simple with the Bing AI Copilot. First off, you can type in saying what you want. Can you make me a or can you provide me with a script for a 3D former game. Oh, you need to be very specific. So, you, can you provide me with a movement? script for a 3D platformer game and I'm using C sharp so I'll put an in C sharp and in unity Let it run for a bit. And there's the script. So that's what I did for the first one. And then I added some prompts here. So then I asked it, can you add a public boolean? to this script by default the shift key pressed is false equals false the player does not sprint when the when the shift key is pressed equals true the player sprints so it goes faster the character goes faster when i press the shift key so for example, if I go into the game, I can walk around and then when I press the shift key, I run or sprint. So that's working out. I go back to the code. Another prompt which I did was, can you add a second jump mid-air to the script so that it allows the player to perform a double jump? So I typed that out into Bing Copilot as well. And then it gave me a script added to this one. I need to say specifically add this to this original script and now I'm able to double jump as well so in order to demonstrate this I'll duplicate the box by control C control V and then dragging upwards I can rotate and now I'll play the game so it's a parkour level so the physics is a bit Off. Obviously, this is not a beginner tutorial on how to use Unity. I recommend you watching Games Plus James to get you started with. There we go. Made it up here. I'd recommend you watching Games Plus James is 3D platformer video so that you know the basics of unity as well 
because there's a lot of things to learn uh, which I can't show you in this video like um, for example if I go to player it's got a capsule collider character controller and you've also got materials and this character is blue and I've stuck a identifier cube at the front of it so that it is showing the direction the character is moving so it goes in the direction that yeah thank you for watching subscribe with the notifications on and like the video so that you don't miss another one from me bye